Hey, it's Brian here uh, from quantlabs.net doing a three-way test of uh, Java versus C++ versus C Sharp just in terms of basic looping, 10 million iterations on a double. Uh, the um, performance is not very much different between uh, C++, C Sharp, and Java. Let me show you. So we're just doing an iteration on a double of 10 million and just uh, calculating the elapsed time. That's it. So let me uh, run this for you. Okay, so this is point zero zero sorry point zero three. Let me show uh, you the C sharp version. Now this is the C sharp version. It's ten million doubles. Uh, same thing. Uh, let's run this. But just between. Uh, C sharp and uh, C plus plus. I mean, it's almost the same. Now, here's the funny thing. Let's run uh, Java in my NetBeans. Same thing. Uh, Ten million iterations. Now, again, I don't really care about database or, or graphic or anything. Even the OS itself. What I care about is just pure, pure algorithmic uh, based type of processing right on the uh, CPU. So let's run that. So it's 0 0.032. Now, uh, they're almost the same neck and neck with everything. Uh, the question becomes, um, if they're all the same on uh, Windows, uh, is there any real advantages that C++ offers? And of course there is. This is a very primitive test. Um, my gut feeling tells me to just stick with pure C++ for algorithms and, and just treat them as a separate library with uh, C Sharp uh, that offers a lot of just rapid development you can get up and running really fast uh, Java in itself obviously just is in its own world it's just pretty isolated from all the other languages uh, and uh, you know the performance is not bad I find Java is very kludgy because you have to run obviously a JVM so that's a dependency which I don't like really uh, doing anymore uh, anything with a JVM or some kind of dependency, ARM and Python are the same way. Where basically, um, you know, it just security-wise, it's just not from my point of view. It's not a, a, in this day and age with the amount of hacking and the sophistication of hacking. JVMs are just vulnerable. I've seen so many uh, vulnerabilities already with the JVMs uh, coming out of uh, Oracle. I don't trust them. So that leads me to uh, C++ and C Sharp as the preferred ways of doing things because they develop, uh, they create their own EXEs during the uh, build process or compile process within Visual Studio. Now, of course, if you're going on to uh, Linux, C++ all the way because you have your own uh, bin file or executable bin file that's being created. So these are the ways I prefer it uh, and then also uh, if you follow me uh, you know my opinion on MATLAB that helps to extend into either language .NET of C Sharp or C++ but when you look at these metrics they're pretty well the same I have read um, from Daniel Duffy uh, that uh, C++ really only offers is about 20 percent faster than uh, C sharp. So if you're needing real algorithm, pure algorithm, C++ all the way. And again, for uh, any kind of uh, GUI front end or whatever, maybe uh, C sharp may not be a bad language to play with. Just my thoughts. I thought I'd put it out there. I just had to do it without reading about uh, all this other third party metrics and whatnot. But I thought I'd just give it a run and just to make sure I'm choosing the right languages and it looks like I am. So uh, hopefully that will help you out. Uh, let me know your opinions. Talk to you later.